Where to, ladies? The 43. Uh, I'm gonna need you to repeat that, please. 43 Inwood Lane in Clark. This is gonna be a long ride. We know. Alrighty then. Is the temperature okay back there? It's fine. Would you guys like any music? No, thank you. You know, my house is way closer. I should be getting dropped off first. It's my birthday. Don't you think you should let me get dropped off first? I paid for the Uber, Julia. Oh, what a great birthday gift that was. You're such a drama queen. Don't act like this isn't a big deal. You seriously screwed up today, Maddie. Well, because you're such an angel all the time. Sounds like you girls need to talk. We are talking. You're not talking, you're fighting. Why don't you tell me what's really going on here? Do you want the short version or the long version? We're gonna be here a while. I think we've got time for the long version. Okay, Madison and I met sophomore year in English class. Oh God, this is the really long version. She was the new girl, and it was first period. She didn't know anybody yet. So then, of course, my knight in shining armor, Julia, came to my rescue and saved me from social oblivion with her incredible bravery in reaching out to the new girl. Um, well, yeah. Hey, you must be new here. <laughs> what gave it away? The fact that you've never seen me before, or me awkwardly leaning over my desk hoping no one to see me? I did not say that. You absolutely said that. We were talking, and we figured out we actually had a lot in common. We both liked English class, horseback riding, Italian food. Emblem 3. Oh my god. We had the same favorite member, too. Which one? Wesley? Ah! <laughs> hey, so, I know this is kind of last minute, but I was wondering if you're not doing anything tonight. Oh yeah, I'm really busy with all the friends I've made in the first 10 minutes since I started school. <laughs> Well, it's my 15th birthday, and I'm having a couple of my friends over for dinner. You should come. I'll be there. Hey, Madison! Hey, happy birthday! Oh my gosh, you totally didn't have to! I more than had to. You invited the new girl to your birthday party even though you just met her this morning. <laughs> hey guys, this is Madison, the new girl I told you about. Madison, this is Rachel, Catherine, and Claire. Hey guys! Hey! hey. Well, now that we've all met, let's cut to the dinner! Oh, praise. <laughs> it's about time. <laughs> You'll help me pick up a brush and figure out where to start. You are home. why I invited her. Oh yeah, who could think you would ever actually like me? You girls clicked. Yeah, I guess so. If you became friends so quickly, you should be able to get past this. We should be if Julia wasn't overreacting so much. The problem here is that you think this is overreacting. What exactly happened today? Madison proved that she's not as good as a friend as I thought. Oh, I'm not a good friend? Why don't we tell the story of your 16th birthday then, huh? I hosted a birthday sleepover with Rachel, Catherine, and Claire. They all fell asleep, so it was just us up. <laughs> <laughs> so Madison, tell me about Will. Shut up. Come on, I know you like him. I do not. You liar, you so do. <laughs> Shut up with me. Happy birthday, Julia. <laughs> no way, is this... Are these Emblem 3 tickets? Ah, Maddie, 
babies must have cost you a fortune! Well, I pulled together all my babysitting money and I bought two, so I was hoping- Yes, of course, I'll take you! <laughs> okay, but that's not all. Open the rest of it. What even is this? <laughs> Read it! <laughs> Maddie, this is amazing! And I presume it was all downhill from there. No, not at all. Everything was fine until today. Let me tell you the story of my 17th birthday. Hold on. Um, girls, I didn't realize this ride was gonna be so long and I haven't eaten since this morning. Do you mind if we stop somewhere? Um, I don't know, I kinda wanna get home. Well, I, I can't make you agree, but it sounds like you need to talk some more. And the french fries are on me. What was that? It's called ketchup. You put it on french fries. You just put ketchup on all of our french fries. And who said I wanted ketchup? Julia, you love ketchup. Well, you could have asked. Now what's the problem? Madison put ketchup on all of our french fries. So, what's really the problem? Madison just always assumes that she knows what I want. She never thinks, she just does. She's not, not always right. Julia, we've been best friends for four years. I'm usually right. Can we tell the story of my 17th birthday? You go ahead. My birthday that year was on a Friday night. She picked me up at seven. She said we were going out to dinner. I have a surprise for you. Is it a sequel to the book you made me last year? Better. Why are we at your house? Yeah, <laughs> no one understands me. It's really not a phase, Mom. It's called yeah. Mom. I'm going to hunt. <laughs> <What? laughs> Surprise! Who are all these people? People from school. School friends. Happy birthday, Je Jessica! <laughs> are Rachel, Kathleen, and Claire here? Um, no. Those three never have any fun. They're my friends. Yeah. Yeah. Last. Uh, Jeez, Julia, I thought I was your friend. But you know what? I'm sorry for throwing you a surprise birthday party. Two years later, and you're really still mad at me for throwing you a party? You didn't throw that party for me. You threw it for yourself. That's not true, Julia. You were the only person there I even knew. I was just trying to help you make new friends. Girls. Girls, you're both being stubborn. Now, this is not going to work unless you listen to each other's grievances. You want grievances? Fine, here are my grievances. Madison, after what you did today, I don't think we should be friends anymore. Well, I think we should get the hell out of here. You girls never finished your story. You need to talk about this. It's not the kind of decision you make arguing over french fries at Burger King. What else is there to say? Tell me about Julia's 18th birthday. There's not much to talk about. That one wasn't bad. It's easy for you to say. You were with your boyfriend all day. Hey, isn't it Julia's birthday? Yeah, she's hanging out with Will. But you guys always spend her birthday together. Why don't you 
collar. Maybe. Is everything okay? I'm fine, Mom. Okay. Hello? Hey, Jules. Happy birthday. Aw, oh, thanks, Maddie. Are you still with Will? Yeah, why? I don't know. I was just thinking... We always hang out on your birthday, so I just thought... I'm really sorry, Maddie, but Will planned this whole day for me and... It's fine, I get it. Maybe next weekend? Oh, hang on. Maddie, I'm sorry. I gotta go. I'll talk to you later. No worries. Bye. And then what? And then we went off to college. Today's the first day we've seen each other since last year. So what happened today? Oh, come on, Madison. Are you really not going to admit it? Are you really going to pin all the blame on me? Yes, Madison, I am. Did you not hear that whole story of all the times you ditched me and took me for granted and now you're trying to say it's all my fault? Nothing I did ever came close to what you did to me today. You never listened to me and now- Fine. Fine, Julia. Today, I messed up. Are you happy? What was that? We got rear-ended. Are you girls okay? All right, I'm gonna check on that guy. Stay here. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm a little shaken up, but I'm okay. I'm glad. Yeah. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. I'm just glad no one was hurt. Yeah. I'm sorry, Julia. I'm sorry too. I'll miss you. I'll miss you too. Girls, there's another Uber here to take you home. Thanks for the ride. You're welcome. Thanks for everything. It's this one. Goodbye, Madison. Bye, Julia. Julia. Happy birthday. Thanks. Yeah. Good now? 